Dear staff, today we take you through the process of how to migrate your webmail account to the new top level domain. By now you should have read through the FAQs and when that is done, make sure you come and click I have read and understood the FAQs. I'll do that and then I click migrate my webmail account. I come and type in my email address tyronmings at dicks.mark.se.ug and then I click migrate account. As it comes up, I'll ensure that I fill in step 2.1 which is to generate my webmail then I'll proceed to step 2.2. First name is Tyron, surname is Mings and then I don't have another name. I'll also put an alternative email address. This is very important for password recovery. Then after that I click generate generate at mark.ac.webmail address. As you can see, Tyron Mings at dicks.mark.ac.ug now becomes tyron.mings at mark.ac.ug. So it's first name dot surname at mark.ac.ug. So at this step 2.2, verification and authorization, I'll put in my password for the old email address. Then I will click start migration. Depending on the size of your mailbox, it will happen quickly or it will take some time, but we have given you a guarantee of 24 hours. Then when that is done, you'll see success and you can read tyron.means that Mark has successfully been set up. You may now proceed to sync or move data from your old mail account. Please note that depending on the size of your content in your webmail account, the process of copying your data may go on for several minutes or hours. Closing or leaving this window does not stop the process of copying your data. After clicking the sync button below, you may proceed to log into your new webmail account using that. So let me click sync. And you can see it's already syncing. So I can come to the window of logging in. Tyron. Tyron.means at mark.ac.ug should be able to log in and see my information. As you can see, the data is there. Thank you for listening. Let us all get onto this process as we continue to build for the future. Thank you.